Yeah, um, I always like to say that the secret to success is doing a lot of little things consistently over a long period of time. Like people see the headline, the 50, yeah. but they don't realize there was a decade that went into that. Of training and building up to it? Everything, you know, you can only get so physically fit for a challenge. And then at that point in time, your mind and your body have to come into alignment and then the mind takes over. And, uh, you know, one of the biggest questions I get is, how do I come or become mentally tough? And, uh, you know, a lot of people say, oh, you're either born with it or is it something that you can develop? And I'm in the, the camp of it's, it's a development process. It's, anybody can do it. And uh, I mean, it started for me in seventh grade. Um, I grew up as a wrestler in Canada and uh, I lost my very first match. In fact, I lost almost every match after that wow. the, uh, the entire season. Um, Why'd you keep going? Yeah, I, I just, you know, I'm, I'm the type of person that I don't, I don't love to be defined by those moments. I, I want to overcome that. And, uh, and so I, I would wake up and study the sport and, and show up and, and, you know, that you always hear, show up early and stay late. Um, and, and I really did that. And by the time I hit my senior year, I went undefeated. Wow. Um, and it's not because I had any talent. Um, it's because I was willing to show up. I've learned to show up every single day. The moment you realize the next step isn't going to kill you, and that next step is the first step to evolving, changing, growing, and learning, and becoming literally the best version of yourself, that's the most beautiful thing. It's not going to kill you. And putting yourself in the game, you're giving yourself an opportunity to achieve something that everybody else had was impossible.